Oh. That was creative. Basic skill. And there they are. The team of the hour. Wow. Press any button, it says. There we go. Oh, is this going to have a sizzle reel? No? Okay. Wow. Uh, yeah, I got chills from that just for a second there. God, I love this art style. Hey, all Decubon here, and welcome to 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. Oh, my. This one snuck under the radar for me, and I think a lot of people, because honestly, Vanillaware, the guys who are, you know, basically known for this 2D hand-drawn anime art style, like, they've been pretty quiet the last few years. I think the last thing I've heard from them was the Odin Sphere remake. And Odin Sphere was a PS2 game that they then ported to PlayStation 4, if memory serves. Uh, I should know that. I actually have a copy of it sitting on my shelf. <laughs> uh, uh, just one more in the mini line of games that I played but never finished. I don't know. Maybe I'll do that one as a LP video later. But, uh, yeah. I think this one just made the LP list by virtue of timing of release. And then I started looking at the review scores, and this thing was scoring, like, eights and nines across the board. I was like, oh, I gotta check this thing out. So, uh, yeah. I know very little about anything about this game, and that's probably the best way to go into games like this, is knowing jack all. I mean, I see an ass load of protagonists. I see a lot of various anime-esque tropes going on here. I see a cat. Morgana, is that you? Man, maybe it is. Kind of even looks like Morgana, black cat with a white tail. <laughs> oh. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> Apparently, if I don't push a button fast enough, it just goes back to that title thing. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I'm liking this. Listen to that. Oh. Ooh, I'm boffing this already. Uh, please select an audio language. Audio language can be changed at any time. Uh ha. Well... Let's see how the English crew does. If they sound bad, I'll change it to the Japanese crew. I repeat. We hmm? interrupt this program to bring you an important emergency broadcast. Okay. A large unidentified object has crash landed in the city. Uh destroying everything in its path. Oh, this is just starting off with a bang, isn't it? Emergency has been declared in Ashitaba City. The neighboring three wards are advised to evacuate immediately. Please defer to the police um, for further instructions. Dude, you're running towards the shit. The are out of Why are you both running towards the, the shit? To face heavy congestion. Proceed with caution. Well, oh, what the? Oh, are you gonna show us some leg? Uh, start. <laughs> oh, oh, anime bullshit! Oh, 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 she did not just... Did she just summon that? Oh, anime bullshit powers, I love you already. <laughs> oh, it's a shonen game. It's really happening. Yep, it's really happening. I'm actually playing this game. Just as you said. A kaiju attacked, like in that movie. A kaiju? So we'll do what we have to do. Get in the robots and fight. Oh, wow. Our fate was sealed a long time ago. Are, am I playing Neon Genesis Evangeli in the game? Uh, is that what this is? Get in the damn robot, Shinji! Oh. Oh, this is cool. What do we have here? May 27th, 4.30 p.m. Uh, yes. The, where did my clothes go? I was about to ask that. Where are your clothes? Daimos signatures approaching. Enemy in range. Daimos? Is that the enemies? My voice? It's like hearing myself talking in my head. 
Also, I'm not advancing the dialogue. It's doing that automatically. Number 15. Oh, shit. Lady, you're. Well, you I, I have no good. idea. Can you hear me? Uh. Gojo Senpai, what are you? Boy, we're just throwing us right into the middle of this. Senpai, are you like Akun too? Did you come from the future? Uh, the future. That later. Wait a minute, is this gonna involve time travel? The we're in. That area is under attack by D forces. D forces. Must be Deimos. That's what they're talking about. <laughs> no time for a full rundown. We'll have to settle for the fundamentals. I, that'll do. I'll take the fundamentals. Controlled with your mind. Oh. Think of it as another body connected to your brain. Oh, it's a titan. Try a mechanical titan. You can do it. And that, that's why all the clothes vanished, huh? Oh, there it goes. But now my head feels weird. It's like scratchy or something. That's the link system of the nano machines inside your brain. Oh shit! You'll also have a direct feed of information from the Sentinel sensors. Nano machines, son. Now it's we're going so Metal Gear too. Speaking directly to you. For now, you'll just have to get used to it as you fight. Can you move? Wow, this this game just I literally throwing me in the deep end here. They're coming closer. I keep getting these pop-ups in the way when I try to look around. That's your equipment interface. <laughs> Use that to neutralize the D forces in front of you. I don't know if I'm doing this right, but how's this? I'm gonna punch you! Oh, tutorial attack. To control your pilots, move the cursor over a pilot and select with X. Once the menu's open, press X to select action and destroy the enemy using arm mounted machine cannons. Battle start. Oh. <laughs> Oh, holy shit, they're shooting at me! Oh, this is in real time. Alright, we've got an HP bar, an EP bar. Stay calm, we can do this. Wait, okay, Sentinel Generation 2. Hm. Action, arm mounted machine cannons. Power 40 times 33, wait 7 seconds? Oh, wait time, I'm guessing. I guess a cooldown before I can use it again. Attacks Kaiju within target area in front of the Sentinel with machine cannons. I mean, oh. Oh, that's... That's cool. Okay, I can see the whole map. Wave, zero of one. City, 99%. I can see, oh. Oh, workers. You guys are just small fry. Here, eat my guns. Oh. I got him. There's more kaiju up ahead. Oh, that's a lot of them. Slow down. Different combat situations might call for different weapons. If they're all concentrated in one area, you could use a wide impact armament like the rocket launchers. Okay, that sounds what? good. What? I have rocket launchers? Uh, okay. Rocket launchers? Oh, where's the rocket launcher button? <sighs> Seriously, haven't you been paying attention? It's in your brain. The rig is on your shoulders. Focus on them. My shoulders. Is this how I do it? Select action and destroy the enemy using the multi rocket launchers. Adjust the attack range with L to target as many enemies as possible. What do I do? Oh, here we go. No, I want this. <laughs> Fire the big guns. Oh wow, Big Guns is right. This thing's got a huge area of effect. Oh, back attack, damage multiplied by 1.5. Even better! Big missiles coming in! Oh! Oh, you guys are all dead. Oh, my energy. What? Oh, Jesus. Uh, Number 15's taken damage to the rear exhaust system. There's a big ass robot there. Huh? Oh. A new player has entered. Sentinel number 13. Activated. Ah. 
<laughs> Another sentinel's been transmitted behind you for you, Saka-kun. Well, that's handy. But who is it? This is Sentinel number 13. Juro Karabi? Karabe? What are oh, you Karabe, okay. I can't let this turn out like Sector 3. Izumi? No. There's no way his memory could have returned. Okay, yeah, there, there's some definite time travel BS going on. This in my dreams. I think I can do this. All right. Wait until we call for backup, Izumi. My name is Juro Kurabe. Select action, then select heavy knuckles. Use L to attack the enemies in front of you while moving around. I gotta think. What do we got? Heavy knuckles. Oh wow, that thing's big looking. Holy shit, the damage on the 1700? Oh, I see, I've gotta move into range and punch him in the nose. Damn! Kicked his ass good. That really isn't easy me. But how? Victory! This is a interesting battle system we got going on here. Kind of like it. Hmm? Me? Oh, hi there. Juro Karabe's story is now available. Oh, am I going to be able to do some jumping around? Uh, menu options. So oh, save, load, title screen, manual, and options, huh? All right. Uh, be right back. Let's fiddle around in the manual really quick. Hmm. All right, let's go through this. We interrupt this program to bring you an important emergency broadcast. A large unidentified object has crash landed in the city, destroying everything in its path. It's currently the news anchor reports the end of the normal life. Among the mass of fleeing citizens stands a group of boys and girls prepared to face the oncoming despair. Piloting massive robots called Sentinels, they thrust themselves into the final battle to ensure the survival of mankind. That's, uh, kind of the end of the thing. What do we got in here? Oh, geez. Juro Karare, Iori Fushika, E, oh, I've got to butcher all of these names. E, Megumi, let's just go by the first names. Shu, Matsuno, Keitaro, Yuki, Nenji. Nenji looks like a badass, damn. Ryoko, Renya, the guy who we were talking to earlier. Tomi, and... T and Takatoshi. Hmm? Uh, quick thing of controls. So, remembrance, destruction, and analysis. Huh, we have a bunch of different modes. So, I'm guessing this is me being able to select which character I'm working off of. And since, you know, we just started, I only got the one. Right. Juro Karabi. The story of Juro Karabi. A few days ago, Sakura High School, Class 1B. May 1985? Wow. We're pretty far back in time. It's 1985. What is going on? Mm hmm? Come on, Juro. Let's go home. Wait, is he time looping? Shibakun. Use L to move and X to talk to people. What do we got? I guess he's the one I need to talk to. Well, he's the only one I can really talk to. Because I can't really interact with anyone else. Uh, is there a, a fast move? Oh, yes, there is. There's a sprint. Circle is the sprint button. Oh. Jump? Oh. Oh, this is kind of like uh, Virtue's Last Reward, maybe, or I'll be jumping between timelines? What's up with you? That's crazy. I just get this weird feeling sometimes. Like something's off. What the... Going to school, living my life. It's like I'm not supposed to be here. <laughs> Dude, I feel that way all the time. Too many movies, man. Kyoto Shiba has been added to the thought cloud. Sometimes when you learn about a specific person or thing, it will be added as a keyword. Press triangle to open the thought cloud to select and contemplate keywords. Shibakun's a bit of a class clown. I can but walk and think at the friend. same time. I always talk to him about action flicks. This is amazing. Oh. Oh, am I walking? Look at. Oh, that's cool. 
Oh, I have four directional. Ah, oh, I'm facing through the desk. This desk, it means nothing to my powers. Huh. Speaking of movies, I brought your video back. Oh. Thanks for letting me borrow it. Ah, uh, he did say he uh, you yesterday. was talking about action movies. You wasted no time. Can you blame me? Giant robots fights in the city? Oh. I was on the edge of my seat. Uh, little prophetic there. <laughs> You sure love Mecca, don't you, Jiro? Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, what do we got? Videotape has been added to the thought cloud. And I'm getting all the random BS popping up on my screen. Go away. Go away. There we go. Some keywords can be used on other characters. When this option is available, a triangle will appear above their heads. Oh, like that. to recommend sure yeah this is uh really i'm enjoying this buff, huh? <laughs> do you think it's too much this is definitely an interesting well, way to do uh, a mentioned. visual novel style game i've been seeing this stuff in my dreams too yep definite movie addiction <laughs> you're showing all the signs soon enough you won't know the difference between fiction and reality oh is that going to be the game's yeah, story yeah. i think i've seen a movie about that the fact that everything's just going to be a dream. Hold circle to move faster. Yeah, I figured that one out. Oh, Yori. fuyusaka sons asleep again. School's out for the day. Should I wake her up? Come to think of it, in that movie yesterday, the girl piloting the robot looked awfully familiar. Oh, were we watching a movie? Is that what that is? Yori, she consider. She always seems to be sleeping. It's odd. <laughs> and then she shows up in my dreams. I can't help but be a little curious about her. Shall we go home with them, Ichan? Uh, sorry. I've got plans with someone. Let me guess. Ah. It's Nenji Kun. Right? <laughs> yeah, no. I mean, it is a guy, but Yuri Chan met someone special too. I'm the only one left. Aww. You're all so lucky with boys. It's not fair. <laughs> Aww, they're adorable. Okay, how does one get out of here? Uh, is there no doors or anything? Hold on a sec, Miyoko. Oh, I need to talk to her, I guess. Do you need something? Uh, not really. I'm just talking to people, man. So Jeez. Okay. And now they're looping. Hey, by I mean, the way, it is a guy. I saw that one video up for rent. Oh, the one you told me that about. That one video? Day. Really? Yep. Gonna rent it. I've got to. Oh crap. <laughs> Give me a minute. I'll be right back. Oh, there was a door there. It's always something, isn't it? Guess I'll wait here. Wonder what he's up to. I do like this, the ability to be able to walk. That movie's a hidden gem. And it's tough listen to, to conversations at the same time. It just makes it very uh very realistic. Okay. Yuri, you're still snoozing hey, here on us. Rise and shine. Come on, girl, school's over for the day. Huh? Just if the, the sun sets by anything. Yeah, I'm gonna say if the sun sets by anything you go by. Another weird dream. And you were there. Huh? Me? Mm -hmm. I was there. What kind of dream was it? <laughs> One with giant uh, robots? Um, dude! Uh, this sucks, man. It's gone, isn't it? Amiguchi anywhere. Oh. Wait a minute, what's going on here? <laughs> you looking awfully cozy. Oh, for Christ's sake, I just woke her up. Give her a second. Like <laughs> oh, he's blushing. Oh, yeah? Then what's the problem? <laughs> Don't mind me. Carry on. <sighs> wow, look at the Sorry, lighting on this. Let's talk about this some other time. 
<sighs> yeah. Uh, she definitely wanted to, uh... Aww. And there she goes. I thought that was the exit, but... Uh, get going too. Hmm? Fine. Aww. Oh, I'll, I'll walk you home! <sighs> hey. Yes. Could you move? Oh, sorry. I guess I'm... Oh. She's sweet. What? I know I shouldn't tease you like that. Oh. It's your fault Everyone's for keeping secrets from me. You're <laughs> really supporting one another. You gonna say anything else? Mommy Gucci. We gotta catch that guy in quick. Okay. You wanna hang out again that badly? It's about He's got all the good video home. games. <laughs> You're just waiting for me to play him. But the sucky thing is, Shu Amaguchi. He's never around unless you make plans. Well, well let us consider. Not the most responsible guy, but he's smart, athletic, and popular with the ladies. On top of that, his family is rich. Oh. He's got all the latest video game consoles in his room. Why do I have a red option? Am I missing something? I can't talk to her. Why do I have a red option? Oh. I see. Uh, I see, because I can talk to him about it. That's why I had a red option. Grabs a snack on his way out. Maybe he's still around. Oh, in the cafeteria? That's right. He was there during break, too. Well, let's go get him. Yes. Can I talk to you finally? Hey, what is it, Sawatari san? Come on. Those papers in the podium. Could you take them to Miss Morimura in the nurse's office? Me? Oh. Oh, well, it's your turn this week. Oh, is it? Eh. All right. Come on, stack of papers. I saw it. There we go. Shouldn't be a problem. Is this it? Wow, that's yeah, good detail. That's right. Not the pickup animation, but the fact that he actually has them in front of him. S Keyword alerts are displayed on the top right of the screen. Ah. Yep. Sorry, I can't. These papers. I need to take them to Miss Morimura. <laughs> Seriously? I'll do what you gotta do. But the facial animations on, on this aren't bad. Right? I'm gonna head over to the cafeteria. Grab your bag and meet me there when you can. Yeah, don't forget the school bag. Additional controls. Hold R1 to fast forward text. Fast forwarding will automatically pause on unread text. Press the touchpad to view the text log. Options to open the pause menu and select manual to view the controls. Yeah, I already read that. Exit classroom. And the only place I can go is the nurse's office. Wow. Excuse me. No loading there. Hmm. She's not here. Of course not. So it gives me a chance to kind of dupe around here. Hello. What should I do with these papers? Can uh, I just leave them here? <clears throat> There's a document with my picture on it. That was a dramatic what sound. What is this? Documents. I'll just take a peek. Oh. Juro Izumi? It's my photo, but... The wrong name. The last name is wrong. I'm Juro Kurabe. Huh. Symptoms. Psyche stabilized via drug administration. Oh. Patient is obedient. General good health. <laughs> Drugs, huh? They've got me doped. <laughs> uh oh. Hey, Kurabe kun. Oh. Uh, hello, boobs. 
Holy cow, girl! That's a rack. Uh, here, uh, have your papers. I think you forgot these. Oh my! You brought them back for me. I was told it was my turn this week. I see. You're a good kid, Karabekun. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate the help. God Shibakun's damn! I should go to the cafeteria. Uh, anything else you could oh, say? One more thing. Yes. Karabekun, how was your current condition? Well, apparently I've been drugged. My condition? You know, any heart palpitations? Yeah, I might be getting some now here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Too close. Are Too close. To sleep at night. Why do you ask? There's a nasty cult going around. At this time She's... of year? That's a bit odd, isn't it? I'll give you some medicine just in case. Oh. oh no, thank you. <laughs> I'm fine, really. I see. Wow. If you'll excuse me. He got all paranoid on us all of a sudden, and kind of understandable considering the paperwork we just read. Oh, hey, oh, there you are. You're still here. Hey, man. <laughs> What's up? Amiguchi wasn't in the cafeteria. <sighs> Where is he? I'd try here. Oh well, yeah, he'd be in here, sure. Do. Let's drop by the video store on the way home. Come on. Same day, heading home, Kiyakicho Shopping District. <sighs> What's up, dude? Big old sigh there all of a sudden. Oh, can I? Got no one else to talk to? Guess not. All right. Something wrong? Uh, he couldn't catch Amiguchi. The video store was a waste of time. This sucks, man. Eh, it's the way the world is, man. It's true that one video was already rented out, but we didn't come back empty-handed. I'm seriously curious what, what this one video like? is. Daimos versus Mecha Daimos. Uh. It's a real masterpiece from '74. Daimos, you say? You your giant robots. Hey, I got a flyer from the theater the other day. It showed what movies they're playing this month. Guess what was on there? The original Daimos. <laughs> Do you want to go? Jeez, a hundred times wasn't enough for you? <laughs> the mighty kaiju Daimos. A sci-fi movie from 1954. Heavy on the special effects. From the 50s. The first in what would become a long-running series. Well, now what? Uh, Can't really talk to you. Oh, I see. Now we can move on. Can move on so with our day. Miyakuna? Mm -hmm. The activation. You know this guy? I know I did it right. Uh. Kitaro Miura. Miura kun. Sure, uh, kun. What's wrong? Is everything all right? You look awful. It, it, Do you you all right, man? I'm fine. Oh Jesus. Your forehead. His forehead was glowing. Did it just light up? And my hand was glowing there for half Sorry, a second. You shouldn't touch it. <gasps> what the? Uh, too oh, late. My hand's lighting up too. Uh, whatever it was, it was contagious. What's going on? This is bad. Oh shit. Signal I... number thirteen, transmitting. Uh. Don't tell me. Are you? I think I just summoned a giant robot. Oh god! What was that? Over there. That, that was really calm. Over there. He summoned a sentinel. Wait. It looks different. That's a robot from that movie. <laughs> you idiot, what are you doing? Holy Send that shit. Thing back. <laughs> I did that? Send that thing back. You're oh, awful calm about this. Code. Uh. He added a forced activation protocol. Holy you shit. This will be interesting. You know Are something. You, you leave me no choice. I'm going to need you to forget about this for now. Um. Shibakun. <laughs> ah. What the fuck is going on? Karabe's prologue cleared. 
to be continued. What the hell? Mystery files obtained eight, event archives obtained four. Close result, mystery files. Hmm? All right. Iori Fuyusaka's story is now available. Interesting. Uh, I can't really change who I'm looking at, however. Hmm. Well, damn. Uh, color me interested in this one. Ah, we've got some serious mysteries going on in this game. All right, guys, I'm going to leave this one here. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this, please leave a like and favorite and subscribe to join me because this one, this one looks good. It's going to be a good one. And uh, let me know what you think of the voices right now. I'm of two minds. We'll see. Might do the next episode with the Japanese voices just to see a uh, contrast and then see what you guys think. But until then, see you guys in the next video.